An agent is a thing that performs a task autonomously. There are three aspects to defining an agent. It's a thing. It can be virtual, such as an application or a computer program, or a physical thing, like an intelligent robot or a machine. It's made up of components. For example, an app consists of subprograms, while a robot consists of many subparts. An agent can exist and function independently on its own, but its components usually cannot. If more than one agent shares the same component, then consider making that an agent by itself. As well, if the component meets a need or fulfills a feature required by the ultimate user, then it can be considered an agent on its own. It performs a task. A forklift in a warehouse performs many tasks, like picking up, dropping off, navigating, recharging, etc. Whereas a spam detector, as the name suggests, only detects spam in email. Further definition of a task versus subtask is not needed. It's autonomous. Technically, rule-based systems are autonomous agents. This includes all software and hardware involved. Rule-based agents need to be told how to go about doing something to the very last detail. We only want to include those agents that don't need to be told exactly how to do something. As long as a system can figure out how to perform a task given boundaries, constraints, and any guidelines, we consider them to be autonomous. Here's a closing note on agents. Agents are made up of three components, a perception system, a model, and an actuator. Kato AI.